Okay, everyone. I'm uh, Spark. I'm a three point two student from Future Shopping Experience. And uh, as I uh, I told you, like this, uh, the purpose of this presentation is to receive some feedbacks of the uh, field directions I try to go. And um, I did some research, of course. And one thing I found out that is nowadays there's uh, the window displays out uh, from the shops are very attractive and they try to attract people's attention. But one thing they didn't achieve is that there are a lot of people just uh, outside seeing the window, but there were, there were very few people actually going inside the shops. So what I want to do is to design a very attractive but also interactive windows which persuade people to go inside the shops. So that's, I can show you one idea I have in mind. Uh, for example, this is a shop. And that's me. And I go near the shop, and, and the, the wall just make a shadow uh, out of me, so I know it's part of, of myself. And I can do some games or play or whatever with it. But as long as I get used to the shadow there, the shadow just walk out, walk in the shop. So I was like, the cure is what it does inside the shop. So I. I have the intention to follow the shadow to go inside the shops. And direction two is information support. And also, uh, the research shows that a good shopping experience requires, uh, requires all the information and when you have a problem, the help will come immediately. But that's something I think most existing shops didn't, didn't achieve nowadays. Um, so how can I provide information or tell the users what's the best to buy, for example? And of course I'll share some ideas. Like I was working at one shop store, uh, once one close uh, closing store, and I was just walking by and there's some uh, uh, some clothes going on, catch my attention. Well, actually that's the one which uh, that's the type which I often buy. So it's a recommendation system which tells me. Uh, What's the new release of the clothes that I might, might be interested? Or the other way, like I went to the shop, there's shadow uh, underneath me, but it's pointing to one direction and it tells you, like, maybe in that direction you are more interested. There are more interesting products. And direction three is online shopping support. Because nowadays, people, uh, the online shopping is really popular now, like, now they, and it's going to develop more. But one problem is that people doing online shopping, they cannot feel it. So they can't trust the product. They don't know if they should buy it or not. Most often, people do feel the product and they go online and buy it. So I was thinking like, if I can develop, uh, design something which people can shop online, but they also get a feeling or get a touch of 3D feeling of how it looks like. But things, the focus of this project is, is in a real shop. So I'm not going to... Uh, go, go into that direction. And direction four is atmosphere creation, because atmosphere at shops is also very important for the uh, for the experience. And which, like this idea, uh, for example, this girl is trying out his, uh, her new clothes in a, in in the try uh, in the change room. And then some pictures she herself like yeah very good, I think. People, most people know that it just shows automatically, but subconsciously, it might encourage more people to buy the clothes. One minute. Uh, actually, it's the end. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm really curious for the feedback, so improvement or any ideas. <laughs>